you know, people don't understand that, like, anxiety, depression, uh, you know, mental disorders, ADHD, they're all superpowers, man. Sometimes people don't understand that when you're taking a pill to suppress something within the body that's natural, obviously that sounds wrong, doesn't it? Doesn't it sound wrong? Like, oh, you're depressed. That means you are feeling this emotion that is uh, of sadness. You're feeling sadness to, if it, whether it's resentment, regret, or learn, or you know, learning some type of lesson. So why would you want to take depression away? Depression makes you understand that like you're a human being. And that like everything happens for the reason that you caused it and the feeling coming after is the consequence or the result or the reaction, the chemical reaction, the body, the intuition. Intuition is the conscious telling you what happened and what's about to, or what's about to happen, which bleeds into, see depression is what happened, what's about to happen, now that's anxiety, anxious, being anxious is intuitively fearing or, uh, or, uh, expecting the future in whether a fearful way or a positive way um you could be that's basically seeing the future intuition intuitive premonition is uh translated to the human uh as a feeling of anxiety because you're like oh no like the, the future is scary because it's unknown how we're gonna get there but whether it's winning a million dollars or going to prison fear or happiness is the result chemicals in your body are reacting to the conscious understanding translated through your DNA and coded as intuitive feelings. Emotions are just the foreshadowing understanding that the mind creates just to, to know how to tell the body what's what to do or what it can do. Like, you know, and then it shows you the more intelligent you are, the more options you have. And the more understanding you have for each option, knowing whether one can bring positive or bring negative results. So everybody in the world is a scientist, a lab rat within their own cage uh, and working in their own lab. The lab is the body, the cage is the mind, and the rat is the conscious. So you're basically just forming your own understandings to lay out your options and your plan for the purpose and the journey of your life. And within that, you can make all kind. the smarter you are, meaning the more intelligent you are, means the more common sense you have to listen or not listen to positive or negative translations uh, from the mind uh, or of the intuition by the mind. So why would you want to take medication to take away anxiety? If you have really bad anxiety, it means that you're not doing something about something that you are thinking about for the future. Anxiety is 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 attached to uh, uh, future tense, like seeing is anxiety is fear of the future, um, and PTSD is fear of the past, which is but both are tied very much towards memory. Memory is a bank. It's like a spank bank, right? Memory is a bank of of pictures and videos and. Um, stories and news feed uh, news feeds that you scroll through through your mind to decipher uh, deja vu and uh, to create coincidence or happenstance now both are created because deja vu is a miracle deja vu means wow I did good because this is happening again and it feels nice but deja vu is also damn I have failed because now I'm afraid of this because it's happening again and it feels bad whereas um, coincidence is more or less a neutral deja vu a deja vu that like it's never happened before but it feels the same so it feels nice therefore deja vu in that sense is neutral so you have the ability to decide whether to reminisce in the time and to soak up the moment feel and understand why you are that person maybe take a break breathe a little bit understand that moment why does it feel the same what could have happened who is this who is around when this happened or what environment what atmosphere take it in use your five senses but deja vu can also be um an intellectual way of telling you that something is supposed to be done whatever it all the all these come from the you know meditation astral projection and consciousness you've got to train that stuff flying around in, in astral projection only makes you smarter within the things that you already know 
memory. Memory is the cure to PTSD. Do not, if you block out the thought, disassociation is the body's reaction. It can also be put on autopilot and you could react to certain environments and things in a disassociative manner because of a blocked out memory. Remembering things, clarity through in memory is the cure to all mental illness. You cure, the, the more you understand the moment, the more the deja vu becomes clear and then the more muscle memory built upon the coinc the feeling uh, of reoccurring feeling of, of uh, you know it's go it's just an understanding bits and pieces of the mind are needed for a whole understanding and without understanding there is no uh, solution without understanding there is no communication without understanding you lose your mind without memory you lose your soul and without love you lose your heart Cyanide Squad, signing out, Poetic Jewels, has spoken. Rest in peace, X. I love you, bro. I feel you all the time. I didn't even have to know you. I know you.